Welcome to the virtual presentation of FlexTrust, a computational threading method for multi-material, multi-form, and multi-use prototyping. I am George Li. I will be presenting our team from International Design Institute of Zhejiang University. Conventional 3D printing models, with like PLA or ABS, are difficult to shape change physically. FlexTrust is designed to make flexible prototype with 3D printers and assemble by threading. As it combines linear material, it expands possibilities of physical properties and provides new HCI methods. By recent works, a hot topic of fabrication is to enable users to receive continuous feedback. Compared to existing methods, we adapt advantages of low fidelity fabrication, interactive fabrication, and construction kits for quick prototyping. Our parametric design tool creates instructive and sensible design by allowing users to on-demand modify with the final artifacts. Let's take Stanford Bunny as an example to introduce our workflow. Firstly, virtual model is imported and simplified. The density can be adjusted. Trust-shaped nodes will then be generated on every point of it. An Euler pass visits every node so would link them together. Then we 3D print these nodes with any conventional printers. A threading process needs a while, but the label on nodes would help users to finish it. We can see the final flag truss bunny is deformable for any on-demand shape changing. Besides the type of nodes on bunny, we develop more modifiable type semi-flexible for compromising objects, and moreover, fully flexible. In addition, we also made fully fixed type as a solid truss without threading. For example, replacing the nodes on Bunny's ear with fully flexible nodes, the modification gives the ears a softer touch that allows deformation in more angles. More wiring and threading material can be integrated with flex truss, including wire, elastic rope, and even optical fiber. For flexible type of nodes, we can largely shorten the manufacturer time by replacing pipe with other material, such as acrylic, PLA, or soft rubber. In theory, flex truss can achieve any simplified shape from digital model. We tested multiple fundamental geometries to demonstrate the feasibility. Then I will show some applications to indicate what we can really do with flex truss. The flex truss workflow enables designers to create on-demand function piece. Video shows it as an example of multi-use handbag. Users can reshape the handbag as functionally needed for telephone or book or other stuff. Threading with elastic rope, we demonstrate a wearable device design. We complete the prototype by reconstructing a whistle band with 40 nodes. The artifacts can be worn by users with different waist size and deform according to the action. We also made an arm band with semi-flexible nodes, embedding an optical fiber. This prototype can give a real-time feedback on various gesture. We adapt SLA printing to explore the minimum size of flex truss. We complete a flexible ring by reconstructing it with 10 tiny nodes. Video shows that the flex truss jewelry can be stretched and worn without breakage. Our final application is an enclosing consisting of three segments. A crop top can be extended into hip length vest, moreover, be further extended as a dress. In conclusion, shape changing, physical property changing, and media embedding features enable our design tool to generate multi-material, multi-form, and multi-use applications. We look forward to extending our method into future sustainable fabrication. Thank you for watching.